Sin Nombre or Without Name from 2009, movie review. A young man is a member of a gang, Willy. He brings a young friend of his, a 12 year old or so, into the gang as well. However, he does have some problems with the activities of this gang. He is starting to feel like, you know, what they're doing is immoral, because that's what all movies involving gangs are about. Then there is another small group of characters consisting of a girl named Syra, if that's how you pronounce it, her father and her uncle. They are trying to get to America from Mexico. These two groups of characters don't at first seem to have anything to do with one another, but when the gang sends Willie and the 12 year old Smiley to kill some people, they. there's a situation. And. Willie ends up on the run from the gang, having saved Syra. Now, the rest of the film is basically about him trying to get away from the gang and her partially on her way to America, but also she of course she of course can't quite help but feel have some feelings towards Willie. I basically went into the movie blind, not knowing anything other than that it was apparently about Mexicans or something like it trying to get into America. I was very pleasantly surprised. The film flies by. I would guess it's about a hundred minutes or maybe a little less. You don't feel that at all. It passes so quickly. It's a very intense film, but it also does not overwhelm you at any point. It really shows with no real holding back the cruel reality of both the gang environment and the situation for people trying to emigrate into the United States from south of the border. The characters are very credible and well written. I've heard some people complain about Syra. I don't really see it. The acting is phenomenal. Every single performance is spot on. Even the 12 year old playing Smiley. The film is very nicely shot and very sharply edited. There are several scenes of physical violence and you feel the punches and the kicks. It's a very brutal and disturbing movie and like I already mentioned it really does not hold back. The lighting is also, excuse me, fantastic. The dialogue does have a few moments, excuse me again, of Hollywood lines, or maybe that's just how it came out in the subtitling. I don't speak Spanish. Overall, if you are at all interested in social realism and movies about the gang environment and or the current situation for immigrants trying to get into America, I would definitely suggest you try to watch this movie. It has been out for a little over a year at least by now. So that was my review of Sin Nombre without 